Okay, here we have a snake. We are in the the, phy <laughs> the phylum chordata, the subphylum craniata, the class reptilia, reptilia and the order squamata. All right, so here is a mouth. So if you look inside of the mouth, you can see we don't actually need that trachea. Why am I talking about the trachea? Yeah, we do. We do? Oh, we do. It got added to the list. So here's the trachea. You can sort of follow it down. And it's ribbed, so rigid. and you can see it like all the way through. So be careful; it could be tagged all the way down here. Um, this here is the tongue, with its forks that I, I'm having troubles separating. Okay. There we go, tongue. We have an esophagus that starts right there. And it goes all the way back like this. I ran into a blood vessel and it stopped me and I didn't want to break it. This is all esophagus that eventually leads to the stomach, which we have cut open right here. Um, right next to the esophagus, this is the liver. The liver, at the end of the liver, is the gallbladder right here. The stomach meets up with the intestine right here. And at this junction, we have the pancreas right here. Um, coming back up, we have the heart right here. This, this whole thing right here is the heart. You should be able to see the black right there. So this top piece is going to be your atria, and this bottom piece is going to be your ventricle. Um, if you follow the trachea, you will find the lung right here, which I'm not sure if you can zoom in and see that, but all these little dots right here you can see. That's the inside of the lung. Nice. Okay, cool. This here, going all the way down. So like this whole thing all the way on the sides and the other side. This is all muscle. Um, let's see, what, what do we need next? This right here is a testy. The other one is right here. You can see it's a lot thicker than the intestine that it's right next to. This little tiny tube, let's see if I can get it right. She probably mentioned when it's on the top of Yeah, this little tube right here that's on the top of the kidney is the um, ductus deferens. Should be two of them. Um, so this is one kidney, and this is another kidney. And as we go back, you can see that we are inside of a tube right here. This tube, hold on, that's in the way. This tube that we are inside of is the cloaca, and the exit to it is the anus. These two things right here are the hemipenes. Did I miss anything? What? The peritoneum. Okay, so the peritoneum is kind of weird. We have to talk about two of them. This membrane right here that I'm pulling is the outside of the peritoneum and the inside would be like for example let's see where's a good part right there this it holds the organs and stuff in place so it should be attached to everything all along in here and you can even see it could be tagged like say right here this membrane holding all this together or you know anywhere around here all of this membrane um, the skin, well, where is that? <laughs> this is the skin. So this right here, this would also be peritoneum that I just pulled off. And is that it? All right, we're done.